twenty one miles. Could at least do is at least you could maybe move your other guys up against the wall so that you're still in cover from the archer fire, but you could then have an easier time getting into the breach on your next turn. To be honest, you can yeah, get into the breach on that... turn this if you want. I think I'll go. Hmm. Take yeah, cover. I guess I'll just go into the breach. Yep. Yeah. I'll drop a, a second token on for you to represent the guys who are hanging back. Okay, so who are you going to try and stab? Um, hybrid it makes two. literally no difference. <laughs> hybrid two, and I'm going to have. Uh, well, they're both attacking at minus one, so. Yeah. Not long for this world. Well, yeah. the hey, at least you're not trying to find any secret doors. <laughs> That's a fumble. We don't need a fumble table. Fumble. You stab Yay. yourself in the face. Wait. There's Yay. a fumble table? Yes, there's a fumble yeah. table. This game has many tables. Fumbles. Roll 1d10, I believe. Uh, it's different for peasants, I think. <laughs> Peasant ceases to exist. A natural <laughs> roll of one is a fumble. Fumbles automatically miss, and the attacker must roll on the fumble table. He rolls. Ooh. Yeah. Lower uh, is better. Roll and, is modified by the reverse of the character's luck. And if you're wearing light and or no a armor, three. So that's a plus three to my roll there. And nice. if you're wearing light or no armor, you roll one d sixteen. So roll a sixteen-sided die, Gray. No, I or think I do one. that. Yeah, he does. Okay, so oh, get, yeah, you get to the odd dice. Right click on the D20. It's in custom dice there. Uh, yeah. Alright. Plus three. <laughs> <laughs> so what happens? You accidentally uh, strike yourself for normal damage plus one. In addition, you fall on your back and are unable to fight <laughs> until you make a DC 16 agility check. Are you dead now? Um... I'm doing 1d4 damage, and I have 4 HP. 1d4 plus 1. Yeah. Nope, 1d4 minus 1 normal, so 1d4 pl uh, okay. plus 0. Yeah. Not great. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did you, what did you kill yourself with again? I killed myself with a crowbar. <laughs> <laughs> so basically, wow. you swing, you hit it, but you hit it badly, you ricochets, and buries in your skull. <laughs> You hit him Pretty with much. the back end of it, it just bounces off and catches you in the skull. <laughs> so, in every, one of us, when one of us needs to get a new pod of peasants, do they keep the items from the old pod? We can do. Alright, let's see if this one hits. It's a pitchfork being used as a spear. Yeah, this should go better. That hits? Yeah, hey. it did. 1d8 minus 2 damage. Yep. Uh, let's see, this is the 1d8. Holy shit! Minus two. Uh, minus, minus two. Minus two. Minus two. Minus two. Six damage. Yeah. You, you skew a, a um, hybrid. Hey! Hey! Yeah. Oh That's god, first case. blood. Yay! What the Yay. hell? First blood happened a few minutes ago. <laughs> well, yeah. For our well, side. first blood on our side against the enemy. It's like, yeah, it's that goal Brazil scored right at the end of the Germany match. Oops, sorry. The yeah. game has been lost, but it's for honor. So yes, you your first kill. William, and William has killed somebody. Dead. He stabs a deep one hybrid. William. The... Yep. Isn't it all the rest of the deep ones now, though? There's still yes. Oh no, it's yeah. You see that mark there? But, That's yeah. a kill counter. I don't expect it to go any higher. No, no. it's um... not for him at anyway, because he's out there alone against the hybrids. I do not All see right. kill marker actually. This is why we were going in my to my hole. We were going fishing. Oh, yeah. Actually, to be honest, I didn't think you had a really good idea. Um, do you want me to edit this so we've got a your kill total as well, or do you just want to track deaths? Um, just track uh, death. Just track deaths. It's simpler for me. Yeah, I think we can easily count how many people we've killed when the scale is one to ten. I think at this point. <laughs> Um, yeah. well, yeah, we all have hands, so... I mean, in a way, I'm kind of lucky, because both my current people actually have range weapons. Yeah. So... You're going to be your fire support. Yeah. 
is George, sorry, George is dead, but is George's pod in the way of me throwing uh, darts or bows at four? Because I think one and three are behind the wall, so I'm not going to be able to hit no, them. I'm playing this pretty loose with, like, grids at the moment. Okay, cool, cool. In that I, case, would yeah, not, I'll... I would I would throwing your bow. <laughs> Very good. Um, all right, fine. First of all, Louis is going to throw a dart. So that's just a straight d20. Probably not. Nope. And then Paracelsus, she's going to shoot a short bow. Straight d20 again. Nope. I think that's just no, missed. That's it? just missed. Yeah. Damn. Well, unfortunately, that is literally my turn because I lost two guys on the way in. So. All right. This guy, effort. this guy is now mm. going to have to make a um, strength check blah, 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 to try blah, blah. and unhook himself. Okay. What do you see? Oh dear. Well, we can... <laughs> oh, <the> fumble. <laughs> 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 and it takes a point. I refer you to. I refer you to my. It is magnificent, but it sure. What is his uh, weapon and armor class, basically? For uh. For well, armor class is fourteen. I think we discussed, yeah. and then. Well, yeah, but he's rolling against his own luck thing. Well, um, no, he didn't fumble. He didn't fumble. Actually. Well, he fumbled, okay. but he fumbled on a skill check, not a um attack check. Yeah. So he's okay. he's fallen to the ground and taking point of damage. You can now. Is he prone? It work. <laughs> yeah. Is he prone? He'll be prone. Drag him into the, the hole. Guy. Okay, hybrid free. Gonna rush in. And it's time to attack him. Um... Shank, 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 shank. <laughs> shank, 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 shank. Both of those characters that are up well, the only character that's up there is William and he has an AC of nine. Yeah. One's dead now, isn't he? And the damage is one D six. It's just oh. dead. No! No, William isn't. Yes, it's yes, William, I am. Isn't? I have only one HP left. He oh, because William died really shot. Yeah. So you've got one guy left. No. No, no he's got no. two. He, he's, got oh, two. Guys. he's got That's the smuggler and the gun farmer. Yeah. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Sorry, but. But yeah, I still need to add an extra dead token and delete this token. <laughs> there. Alright, so what okay, am I going to so do that, with my last that, hybrid? That didn't go well. No, uh, no, no. Could blow the conch for, a, uh, for another volley of arrows? Uh, yeah, he's going <coughs> to fire out some arrows. Oh, God. I didn't mean that oh, literally, no. Gray. Is, is Why did you do arrow? this? <laughs> it's fine. But who am I going to attack? Fine. Apparently, it's okay. a cat. <laughs> Sure, why not? Yep. I, I Look, Baz wants us to live because the cat's coming to to, ass to assail you. Okay, so I'm gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So D eight going from left to right. You can't Ignore just do a D seven. I can't just do a D seven, but I've done D eight. Five, two, three, four, five. Margaret. Margaret. Oh no. D, D Margaret. Nine. It's a hit. Uh, it matches, <laughs> but okay. Yeah. yeah Isn't that your last hit. character too? No, she. No, Margaret and Tony are still alive. It's just Tony's on one HP. Uh, now Margaret's on one HP too. Nice, <laughs> nice. But yeah, you survive. You get through that. Now it's Margaret's turn. Uh, in no. agony. <laughs> yeah. Um, let's see. What does Margaret <laughs> have? She Short has a deer pelt, flint and, flint and steel. <laughs> we have oil and a duck. I'm going to combine things to make a distraction bomb. Oh, no. <laughs> literally be... burning the duck. <laughs> so, this will be an intelligence... So, Matt, would I make a plus one? Can I make an intelligence checks to combine duck, oil, and uh, fire? Yes. Um, <laughs> okay. So what happens if you fail this? You set yourself on fire. No, so again, no, I have a fiery duck, <laughs> and so I'm going to launch a fiery duck missile at the, <laughs> at the, at the uh, horde of deep ones, confuse them. Apparently this duck <laughs> just goes straight forward, on fire, slams into a deep one. <laughs> which oh my which, God. which one do you want to hit? <laughs> I want to hit the group over here, the, 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 uh, the, one, the ones are over in this group right here. Yeah, hit the ones in the breach, not the ones that. Yeah, in the breach. So the breach is now the, the deep ones are now uh, occupied by burning by bur by burning peaking duck. <laughs> My God! <laughs> what the fuck? 
Uh, I'm calling it Dover Duck. <laughs> yes, <laughs> Dover Duck. Dover Duck. Yes. Oh, that's the episode Dover title right there. Sacrifice is not your sacrifice will be in vain. So this going to become a standard French weapon. <laughs> It doesn't do any damage. It doesn't do any yeah. damage, or does it just does it just like With the crit? I think it should. Yeah. You know how like the Finnish invented the Molotov cocktail because bombs are being dropped on. I think yeah. here we've just invented the Dover cocktail. D four minus two. D four minus two. Okay. Is there a chance of setting them on fire? Okay. <laughs> I don't Status think deep ones are flammable. Rip. Oh, oh, rip. Status, I love the status modifier to Deep One Hybrid 3. Burning Dover Duck. <laughs> <laughs> In all caps. That was her turn. That was Bo that was the turn it was Margaret's turn. <laughs> we follow the um, duck to glory. For for oh. Tony for Tony, since he just got his duck in oil yanked from him. Oh dear, dear, dear. What's my TN? Or DC rather? I think the armor class does, is fourteen. Yeah. If that's what you're asking. Does, does burning Dover duck? Does burning Dover duck make, make ar reduce armor class? No, we have plus one to hit. So yeah, let's call it a thirteen. Okay. Try if we survive this, we have left. First, I think Shay will go first. Oh, dang! Just off close. Oh, hang on. First, actually, I'm going to switch Shay and Vasilis' weapons. So, Shay has a dagger now. Oh, yeah, that's Vasilis a good point. Vasilis has the spear! Because Vasilis actually gets a plus one to damage. Or, really actually, wish... yeah, plus one to everything. Yeah. I it. wish Burning Dover Doug did two damage, at least. It is sad. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. Crit. What's a crit do? Critical Ultra hits. did. Um, roll. Here's a crit table, actually, for yeah, business. All table. level zero and all wizards. Uh, I'm guessing that's just a flat roll, then. Roll 1d4. Oh. Plus your luck. 1d4. Yeah, because it's basically, you don't get the full ta table until you become an actual hit hero. Until you oh, suck. Minus this. one because luck. Yeah. Damn it. Um, <laughs> what does that blow shoot. Wait. Yep, yeah, shift is your weapon free of your grasp. In fact, one d damage with this strike and you were disarmed. So Plus one d Okay. <laughs> nice. <laughs> so basically, you're swinging really, really hard. So one d So that is one d8 plus one plus one d6. Yep. He's probably dead. One d8. So that's five plus. Oh, yeah, nine. Yeah, total. You, you shank yourself a deep one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. are, are, you, are you using a pitchfork right now? Uh, uh, that, that was just a <laughs> spear, actually. I got you. So you basically you shank them, you lift them up, you're like, ah, hey, you hey, it's off in the air. It's like you're the like you're from my old family in the uh, Pendragon campaign. You get yourself a boss pole. <laughs> <laughs> Then Thomas yeah, is going to hand Vasilis back the spear. <laughs> Can you just pass weapons around like uh, that? Would, yeah, not. Not, not like this easy, no. no you be, can't use the same weapon two. multiple times. Uh, well, uh, no, I was just handing it back to him because he dropped it. Oh, oh you oh, so, again. So a third oh. character is picking up the dropped spear and giving it yeah. to... That makes sense, yes. Okay, that's, okay that, that sounds better. That's the third tool. Right. And then Kelso is going to just stand there and look cool, I guess. We should have a go at hammering the other deep one. Yeah, yeah. Eh, it's a bit try. far away, but you know what? Fuck it. Yeah, I said, Pete, I'm saying this is a, a mobile melee, so. <laughs> Another crit. <laughs> yeah. God damn. <laughs> we live, we die, we live again. We're all a bit of crit this time. Again. Luck, so another minus one. Yeah. That's actually fine though, if you get another zero. Well, one. Uh, one. Opportunistic strike, inflict plus 1d3. Yeah. Okay. Still, it's 1d4 so plus 1d3. Yeah. Roll a seven. 
No, not yeah. happening. No. Two points. Uh, Two no. damage. No. He's still alive. All right. So, Albon's group. Oh wait, did Tony do anything? I don't oh no, wait, they did both did the same thing. They did okay, the same ahead. thing, yeah. So they're gonna run up and try to kill steal this guy. Slide. <laughs> well, you he is not down, so he is he's prone. prone. He's prone. What does prone do? I'm trying to look it up. Uh, if you're in melee, it's plus two, I think. Yeah, it's plus two. If you, yeah, he has please plus two AC to any uh, basically range attacks, but he in melee he gets negative two AC. Oh yeah. well. Yep. Well, yeah. Yeah, your attack roll modifier is plus two. <laughs> Freaking <melee>. curve stomp. <laughs> <laughs> well, see how much damage you do. Still alive? Yeah, not enough to kill him. So next I got round. More people. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> I got more other, people. <laughs> grab your other person. Throw your other peasant at it. When a fight is just plain wrong, you must sing the curb stump song. <laughs> Oops! Crystal, fumble. Uh -oh. yeah. So Don't fumble. hit your foot. Roll a fumble. Right, he's unarmored, so it's just a d4. Peasant attempts to eat sword. Yeah. You're like Minus sword. your... What? What's your... Who's this one? <laughs> your incompetent blow makes you the laughing stock of the party, but otherwise causes no damage. Okay. Well, what's your, Everyone your point and laugh. All these guys look to look the zero modifier. Oh, okay. Alright, your last guy. Mm, nope. Yeah. At, At least, least it wasn't a crumble. Yeah. Yeah, true enough. Back up to the top. Okay, um... Well, we may as well just rush him. And I'll try to... Kick the shit out of him. Okay, so... <coughs> John the Ostler. <laughs> 1d20 plus 1. Yep. Another crit. Ooh. Hey. Okay, you guys are getting the look back after losing all those peasants. Yes. Apparently, <laughs> yeah, apparently it's, they it's were a, nothing but dead weight. It's the ninja <laughs> rule. The more the more peasants there are, the worse we do. So what is it? One d four plus uh, nothing. One. Uh, minus one. Your luck. Your modifier. Yeah. yeah. So minus minus one. Three, no, so, one. A one. So, 1d3. Uh, so, it's plus 1d3. Okay, so, it's 1d4 plus 1. 1d3. 1d4 plus 1d3. Yeah, so, it's 1d4 plus 1d3. So, 2 damage. And then the 1d3, no modifier. Hey. Yeah, you kill the hybrid. Yes. Nice, nice. Blood. <coughs> Okay, well then, no, I'd no, no. John the cut purse. Then, well, suppose we run up and try to kill the the, the next one. Okay, so what has he got? He's okay, just a straight. So he's trying to miss shank, shank, and shank. Oh well. Well, I guess we're just gonna oh, run up and try to take the hybrid. You got all a bunch of kill stealing bastards. <laughs> hey, I, I got my kill. Because I look at the brass, you're doing better than I am. I've literally fired one bow and arrow and thrown a dagger and missed everything. Darn. You are right. valuable. Remember, later. you do have all the items of your other peasants, so you have a duck and a torch. I do. <laughs> <laughs> I also have a lantern and a pony. <laughs> no, the yeah, pony still... died. Oh, that's... No, no, he still, no, he still, he still keeps the pony. Surely, yeah, I mean, the pony's around. No, Otherwise, no. it's sort of unfair. Lightning cannot strike twice. We will not light a second duck on fire successfully. <laughs> light the party yeah. on fire. <laughs> anyway, Loomis is going to try and hit him with her club. Isn't this, um... No, wait, this is number four. 
Yeah. So I assume I assume the pony it's is the just sort of like left. walking around the beach looking Ooh. for something to eat. Um, yeah. Before they bolted, having had arrows slammed into them, and just said, "Fuck this, I'm That's out." Remember, this is only yeah. a very small section of the wall. Mm. That's enough to kill. Yay! Yeah, we're, we're the PCs, and we're actually doing pretty well. How's the rest of the like beach looking? Um, this is the only this. breach. Just don't look left and right, basically. Just keep on marching forward. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> don't look back. Yep. <clears throat> Just keep going. Lunas is smart enough to not look back. Yeah. Well, to be honest, if you look back right now, we're probably just going to see mages blowing themselves up. Yeah. That's going to okay, be so however, thing is hell how, because there are mages. However, yeah. Luneth is not smart enough to not become a mage. Do we get yeah. experience yeah. from that? Yep. That's okay, hey, Gray? Yeah. Gray? How much? Sorry. Two, 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 two more? Yeah. So we got four. Okay, Gray? Yeah. I'm going to find that burnt duck. <laughs> S and the, you uh, never expect I put it on your chain. Yep. Yeah. So now you've got a flaming duck flail. Well, no, it, <laughs> it'll be got, it'll be gone out by now. Ducks don't burn no, that long. No, it's no, just, just extra rations. I was thinking, and um, the chain is just mine already, so look, I wanted it back. The cooked you can duck. The replenish that sack of the sack of gong relatively easily. <laughs> the cooked duck can be useful if it was used to like um, lure out some more monsters. Like, hey, look, there's fresh cooked duck over here. It's we just slightly charred. We have a meat for that. Oh god, that was terrible. <laughs> that was terrible. <laughs> <coughs> okay, so we're taking nice the breach. All gone. So meh. Yep. Once more so, onto the breach. Do you still have a Thank sack you. though? All right, and also we collect our uh, we collect our um, what do you call those things? Uh, grappling hooks and such. Oh, yeah, what the corpses weapons? are also. Can we take weapons from the deep ones? No, they would have died with the deep ones. Yeah. Oh. Um. Do we? Does anyone? I have some linens and some herbs. Does anyone need like any uh, slight healing or something? I can think I make an intelligence yeah. check. The just yeah. points at the giant arrow sticking out of his chest. <laughs> uh, would it be okay? Okay, er, okay, so would it be okay if I could buy my linen and herbs to make an intelligence check to see if I can heal uh, Demas a little bit? Yeah. Don't fumble. All right. All right if, no, you, not... if you fail, you cut off his leg. Plus one. It's a ten. So it is a ten. The Margaret is at plus one. That'd be a pass. Yeah, that'd be nice. You can make an attempt at healing. So D four. Or D4 minus. Why do you want to go for D? What, what, what's the dice you want me to roll? I'm just having a quick look. Okay. Because it's not. Yeah, there's actually no medical cover, is there? They don't expect you to have survivable wounds. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder <laughs> why. Yeah, be later in the game. Well, I'm making an impro I'm making an impromptu poultice, so. Uh, make it D4. Okay. Nice. I know that's a massive amount, but well, he doesn't have that much HP, does he? She. Uh, yeah. Tomas is a he, yes, and uh, that heals him up to full, and then some. Yep. Yep. He's super strong uh, now. Okay, so above you rear the cliffs of Dover. Well, yeah. I have, I have uh, rope and a grappling Same here. All right. So. How are we gonna do this? Yes. Yeah. You, how much? Um, how many votes and cracking votes do you have? Two. We have. Um, I have one. He has one. So we can make two rope. We can do make make two rope lines and then uh, and you know have make two modes of of, of sailment. Just the thing is that we just need some people to go and make um, we need two belayers. People to go up there and make a path for people to climb. Uh, so oh, who's got the base agility modifiers? Uh, not me, I'm afraid. So, Probably yeah. my cut purse. On my side, I'm gonna hand my own rope off to anyone, because my best ones are for the people who are dead and they were zeros. Ah, okay, well, Jean the cut purse will try to climb. I'll give Jean my other rope grappling, my grappling hook to, uh... Are we given, like, any instructions on what to do if we do, by some miracle, manage to create a breach? Keep climbing. Keep no. going. 
No, keep going. We're supposed to take the city. We're supposed to take the city. Remember? Yeah, keep going until I don't know. You reach Scotland or something. Okay, so we don't actually get reinforcements until we've already Somebody dies. Until the next wave, people come back, come up behind us until our full person gets potted. Yeah. Okay, so I suppose Sean the Cutpuss will try an agility roll to get up the cliff. Mm -hmm. So just a D twin. Are you going to try and D20 climb the whole lot, one? or are you going to go up and like put your rope up a certain height? Well, the ropes are 50 foot long. How tall is the cliff? Probably about 150 feet. Guys, we have a problem. <laughs> yeah, no. we don't have shit. Um, okay. Actually, oh, I, don't know how oh. I don't know how tall they are at Dover. They can be up to 350 feet tall, the cliffs of Dover. Yeah, that would be a bit of an ask to get us to climb there. But they won't be that tall at Dover. We could just scavenge from any of the other peasant bodies. I mean, we weren't the only people who went in. Maybe they had rope? Maybe make rope out of the clothes of the people that have died? <laughs> I've got 10 feet of chain. Well, okay, that, that, that still gives us 40 feet to go up. 30 feet, because I also have 10 feet of chain. Okay. So, um... <laughs> I got a bridle. There are I don't enough know how of much us. that adds. There are enough of us to make a human tower mm -hmm. that um, is at least twenty-five feet tall. Yeah, but then what happens yeah. to the person, that left, the people left at the bottom, when the human tower is no longer tall enough? They hold well, on you grab really them. fucking tight. Yeah, I, suppose, I guess I we're okay. going to just have to take strip the uh, clothes off of the okay, dead I, peasants. I think the, I suppose John could climb up like thirty feet. Sort of, so climb up 80 feet, tie the rope, and then people have to climb up 30 feet to get to the rope. It's the shortest distance to fall, so it shouldn't be that bad, but I mean, 30, 30 foot fall is probably still a deadly a drop. Yeah, I don't know what we're going to do, guys. <laughs> we could always look up and down the wall to see if there's, you know, stairs. <laughs> <laughs> I well, the fishermen did have to get down here somehow. True. They, they came through the town, which is currently being fought out. Yeah. Um, okay, so wait, does wait, anybody wait. have any We're ideas? We're looking for, for a, a tunnel, rope? right? In, a, in the cliff. On the, in the cliff or on top of the cliff? Well, it's not going to be on top of the cliff because there's no rock over it to be a tunnel. At so, that um, would it be built making a tunnel? Well, Basically, perception is intelligence checks here, so could we say, since we're at the cliff wall, do a quick scouring to see if we can find anything that looks tunnel-shaped? Right. Yeah, you can look up. What kind of DC we here? Partway up the cliff. Probably not. My eyes explode. Oh, wait, wait, no, wait, I have Tony. Tony can do it, too. Okay. Do I, I've just found a elevation map of the um, UK. Found it. Okay, um, so Dover from the beach, it's an elevation of two hundred and forty three feet. Guys, we're not climbing this cliff. <laughs> you are, no, don't worry. We'll just send a hundred feet till you can find like a, a ledge. That's okay. a ledge. This is an so, alternate reality, so yeah, the cliffs are completely different topology. Okay, so can John the cut the cut purse climb up fifty feet, then tie a rope into the cliff? Which he ties to himself, for which he will then climb the rest of the hundred, the rest of the fifty feet. Yeah, you can try creating a little like stop point. My my yeah, barber right. has an iron spike you can use. So yeah, yeah. that's kind of useful. Hey Gray. Yeah. Did we see where the uh, cave is? I mean, I did roll an eighteen there. Yeah, you can see kind of like a, a ledge with what seems to be an entrance on it. Awesome. How high up is that? A hundred feet. Hundred feet. <laughs> we okay, have enough so for that. Now, we do. Yeah. How much? Okay. So what am I roll? Okay, I'm rolling a d20, but like plus what? Uh, strength check. Strength. But you check. also have that spike, so. Okay. Well, then if it's strength check, then it's Jean the Osler that's going to try to climb. Yeah. You can have a plus one for having okay. like equipment. Uh, okay. So how far will I climb in the first check? Um, probably to the maximum length of the rope, so 30 feet. Okay, I'm going to try to roll now. 